Hello YouTube, this is Brent Time from Team Lucky 7 Gaming, and today I'm going to show you how to mod your 7 Days to Die to add more players to your actual single player world, or multiplayer world as it is. Alright, so things you're going to need, and I will have a link in the description below, you're going to need Notepad++ plus a um, plugin that I'll put in the description, and uh, all you're going to need to do is this will also be in the description this is the guy that uh, showed it off his name is warbo 201 and all you gotta do is open your seven days to die folder it might be in your program files x86 um, once you're in there go ahead and go to uh, data uh, no seven days to die underscore data managed and then this is what you need the assembly c sharp dot dll um, so what you're gonna do from here is you're going to right click edit with C++ alright now once you have the plugin installed just go to plugins hex editor and then go view in hex alright now the next part is is you go you come down here and you're gonna copy this with control C or right click and copy it then while in the editor go ahead and hit control F and then type control V and then find okay now this is going to be the line alright so in this line you can go right here okay see this is the thing you want to change 1a equals 4 players 1b equals 5 players 1c equals 6 and 1d equals 7 as well as 1e equals 8 so I'm gonna go ahead and change it to 1e and I've now successfully made it an 8 player world I hit save and then now I can play seven days to die, eight players in my multiplayer world. Thank you for watching. I hope you had a great time. This has been Brent Time from Team Lucky 7 Gaming. Goodbye. Hey, thanks for watching. Remember to consider leaving this video a like and adding it to your favorites. And if you get a chance, go ahead and subscribe to our channel for future content. Thank you and have a great day.